Hi friends, in this video, I'm going to write a small Java program to convert a list into a, a map. I've created a class called list to map demo and main method and there is a class called animal. So we are going to create the animal objects and add it to a list and then convert into a, a map. So I created four animal objects with the attributes and there are two different types wild animals and the pet animals then i created the list and added these objects i've written two methods one is without using java 8 streams and the other one is using java 8 streams let's see in the first method i didn't use the java 8 streams at all it's normal for loop iteration so i created a map and then i iterate the list and inside the for loop i have an if condition i want to add only the pet animal into the map so inside the map the key will be the animal id and the object itself and then once the map is ready i'm going to print it in the console so one of the challenge might be inside the for loop we might introduce some temporary variable which might be challenging in multi-threaded programming so it might have some race conditions in the second method we are going to accept the list and then we are going to create a stream so stream of objects going to flow so instead of if condition i'm going to use filter here so filter is similar to if condition so i'm going to filter only the pet animals and then very important point is collectors collectors as set of methods which is called as to map to list to set so using this to map i can create a map with key and the value so key here is id and the value is the object itself once the map is ready i'm going to print it in the console so few advantages of functional programming is brevity we call it as brevity brevity means brief or concise the code becomes very brief and concise and the other advantage is we don't use any shared variables or temporary variables which might result some side effects during the multi-threaded programming so there are many advantages of functional programming so when i run this program i'm able to see the output in the console so we are printing the pet animals it's a very small program to convert a list into a map using java streams please try out hope this video is useful thank you